the actual um, financial performance. So, um, specific words there are revenue resource limit. Basically, what that is, it's our budget or the allocation that we've been given for the year, and we had £261 million for our just over 200,000 population um, for, to, to spend for the year. Um, what our target was for the year was a four million pound deficit. Now, unfortunately, as I mentioned, we, our actual performance was a seven point four million pound deficit, um, and that's not greater year on year because four million of the seven point four was actually repaid in the previous year. So, uh, it's uh, it's a difficult situation once you get into it. Um, so, because we spent more than our allocation, um, that's actually unlawful for health bodies to do that. So um, our auditors wrote a section 30 to the um, Secretary of State, um, so that was, that, was, that was difficult and as you can, might imagine from the press etc, we were one of quite, quite a few um, health bodies that that happened to. The, on the positive side, we managed to manage all of our cash um, within the limits that were given to us. Um, and as uh, Paul mentioned earlier, um, we, we, there were quite strict controls on how much money you can have to actually run uh, your health services, and we are quite low compared to so the target was just over nearly £22 million, pounds, uh, sorry, £22 pounds per head of population, and we are just over 18. Well, why is that? I don't understand why you don't get £22, pounds, if that's what it comes Oh, We do actually receive that, but we yeah. don't spend it. So we, 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 we use that for, to spend that on services uh, rather than running, running sort of management Is that the right way to do it? So if we'd have spent the £22 per head on, on the running cost of the CCG, then the difference between those there would have made the deficit even greater. Yeah. Yeah. So rather than 7.4, it would have yeah. been probably 8.8. 8. Yeah, 8. Yeah. When you use the term target, the target says to me something you aim at. You, you, that's yeah. what you aim your costs at. Uh, yeah. Therefore, that should be the budget, in my view. So, I'll have, yeah. I don't understand it, perhaps. Yeah, I mean, I think it's more <coughs> to prevent other health bodies from spending more than that. So, it's, it's a sort of upper limit of what we can spend up to. Yeah. Um, and we're, we're in, a, in a position that we are able to stay within it, but a lot of, of organisations would possibly go over that if, if they were allowed, which is just too. What's the section 30 piece, and at what kind of level of depth do we start looking at things like cap expenditure plans? Because we're all reading horror stories about neighbouring places like Surrey having to restrict non-emergency angiography. Yeah, section 30, it's, um, it's basically a, a the Section 30 relates to the Local Audit and Accountability Act and it's, um, it's because it's unlawful for health bodies to actually um, spend more than they're allocated. Um, we, the actual Section 30 itself is, is just simply a letter that the auditors write to the Secretary of State. It's a, it's a formal process, we've never had, we've not had any feedback from it and there's probably about 70 of them written to various CCGs and so probably the best part of 40% of the CCGs are, are in that sort of situation. So, may I ask, the CCG running costs are £18.83 per head. Are you likely to have that cap down to £18.83 per head next time? No. Rather than giving you £21.74? No, it's, it's a standard allocation for each, um, health, each CCG across the country. Um, so it's about 200 CCGs and they've all acted exactly the same. It's purely a measure to control to make sure people don't go above it. But they wouldn't turn around and say to we you can run it for that, that's all you get. No, no. no. So, so as an organisation, yeah. yeah. So, 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 yeah. so, so yeah. 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 Well that's our normal corporate structure. Yeah. 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 So we've we've opted to spend the excess on patient care yeah. because yeah. at the end of the day that's probably what we would rather spend our money on. Should the last word on there say limit rather than target? That would make more sense to me yeah. if it said limit. Yes. I'd understand that's the sort of cap rather that's than a target. It's, it's something different that you aim at. Yeah. Yeah.